Jennifer Lawrence is one of the best known and best liked actors in Hollywood, having made films that have conquered the box office and ruled the award ceremonies. But what's the best Jennifer Lawrence film? Well, that's what we're here to find out. Hey there, Tim from Screen OD here. I hope you're doing well and having a good day. Thanks so much for tuning in. Hopefully we can make your day even better, especially if you're a fan of Jennifer Lawrence, who has made some incredible films over the last decade or so. And in fact, there's sometimes too many to choose from. But we have done that. We have created seven of the best Jennifer Lawrence films, and we're going to count them down now from seven to one. Before we get started, a quick reminder that if you haven't already, please do consider subscribing to the channel. And if you like any anything about this video then do of course hit that like button so more people can see this content right let's start our countdown of seven at number seven which is the best place to always start and the film that we've got first on our list is red sparrow in this 2018 spy movie, Lawrence plays Dominika Egorova, a Russian ballerina whose career is ended by an injury and quickly finds herself drawn into working for the Russian government's secret military services. She attends Sparrow School and becomes one of the most formidable agents. But the plot thickens even further when she's approached by a CIA agent who wants her to believe she can trust no one else. An action-packed drama and thrilling adventure with a great versatile performance in the lead role from Lawrence. Do you ever wake up in the night and you can't get back to sleep? I know, it's annoying, isn't it? It's so frustrating. But if you think that's bad, you want to find out about the problems of the guy in this next film. We're talking passengers. Everyone loves a sci-fi romance story, right? Uh, well, if the answer is no, then you probably should just skip to the next entry, as Passengers certainly has quite a lot of both. An intriguing tale, the movie sees Chris Pratt on board a transporter spaceship filled with thousands of people frozen in time due to be awoken after 90 years. However, an asteroid collision has woken him 90 years too early, and after running out of things to keep himself sane, he chooses to awaken another passenger, Lawrence's Aurora Lane. This is an intriguing story of ethics and relationships that play out in an excellent movie. For those who like superhero films, never fear, you have been waiting, but your wait is finally over because at number five we have, well, you guessed it, a superhero film. It's X-Men, Days of Future Past. There are some movie fans who don't take superhero films as seriously as perhaps they should, but the times, they say, are changing, and Jennifer Lawrence's central part in this complex and well-executed role has quite rightfully won her a lot of praise. Her portrayal of Raven slash Mystique in the movie is a highlight of a film which sees her play opposite a very strong cast, including Hugh Jackman, Michael Fassbender, James McAvoy, Halle Berry, and Elliot Page, to name but a few. Well, worth checking out this one. No matter how many brilliant performances she gives and awards that she wins, Jennifer Lawrence will always be associated with this next role. At number four is, of course, The Hunger Games. The first instalment of the movie series that would go on to make an international superstar of Jennifer Lawrence, this dystopian film released in 2012 and is based on Suzanne Collins' novel of the same name. Set in a post-apocalyptic future in the fictional nation of Panem, the often grim story is based around female and male competitors forced to compete in an elaborate televised fight to the death called Hunger Games. When Katniss Everdeen's Lawrence young sister is called to take part in the deadly contest, Katniss takes her place. The birth of an epic and well-loved film series, this is a hugely impressive performance from a young Jennifer Lawrence. We're into the top three. Exciting times, especially for those who want to know what's in the top three. And do you want to know what number three is? I'll tell you. It's Winter's Bone. 2010 coming-of-age story starring Jennifer Lawrence as Ree Dolly, a poverty-stricken young woman in the Ozarks in Missouri who is on a mission to locate her missing father and save her family from being evicted. Based on a novel from 2006 of the same name by Daniel Woodrell, this is a powerful story that sees Lawrence rise to the challenge of a complex character trying to survive in a murky world of drugs, double-dealing and family politics. Her performance won Lawrence a nomination for Best Actress at the Oscars, the second youngest person to receive a nod at that time. At number two, we have a film that was what I think you probably describe as an award magnet in 2013. It's American Hustle. 
But here we are, we're at number one with the best Jennifer Lawrence film of all time. We've gone from seven all the way down to one and what a journey it has been. Thank you so much for coming on it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you are enjoying what you are seeing. Right, at number one we have a film that's probably not that unexpected for those who know about Jennifer Lawrence's work because it's a film for which she won an Oscar. It's Silver Linings Playbook. Another David O. Russell movie with another exceptional cast. Silver Linings Playbook is based on Matthew Quick's 2008 novel and stars Bradley Cooper opposite Lawrence with Robert De Niro, Jackie Weaver, Chris Tucker and Julia Stiles also in the film. It tells the story of a man played by Cooper who has bipolar and is released from a psychiatric institution to live with his parents. He meets a young widow played by Lawrence and she begins to help him get his life back on track. The beautiful and complicated relationship develops as they train for a dance competition and get to know one another further. The performance won Lawrence an Oscar, making her the second youngest best actress in the history of the Academy. Right, so that's it. That is the best Jennifer Lawrence films that you can watch. They've been ranked from seven to one. Hopefully you have found something good to go and watch there. Is there something missing from the list? What would you include on the list? Why don't you leave in the comments below your favorite Jennifer Lawrence films? Thanks so much for watching. If you've enjoyed what you've seen, why not subscribe to the channel and hit that like button so that more people can find this type of content. Right, go check out the other videos across Screen OD. We've got other best of lists of actors we've got great shows that you can stream right now and all sorts of curated collections that hopefully will make your streaming life much better we'll see you again very soon